It's not only uh, members that aren't coming back, there's gonna be a ton of gyms and studios that won't be able to come back. Exercising at the gym might not be accessible for many Canadians right now. But do you plan to return to the gym after getting the COVID-19 vaccine? While fitness centers struggle to survive, a recent global study reveals more than one third Canadians do not plan to return to the gym post pandemic. In Canada right now, it's about 32.8% have canceled memberships at this point in the pandemic. And there's another 33% who has said they have paused their gym membership. So that's more than half of the members serving from Canada specifically saying, we're not paying our gym right now. Either they're gone or they're just not paying and they're pausing their memberships, which is a huge drop in revenue for gyms. Surveying over 11,000 gym members across the world, the study reveals currently only 15% Canadians are using their gym physically or online. Those who run fitness centers say the numbers aren't surprising and the drop in business is the reason many gyms are struggling to stay afloat. We're anywhere between 40 to 60% uh, loss. Um, again, building them back up every time we open, we start to slowly build again and come back down. Um, so there are a lot of different reasons. Um, the majority of people that have dropped off have been ones that um, had their membership on hold the entire time and uh, now have decided, you know what, I might as well just let it go and then see what happens from there. Um, but yeah, you know, the main reason is um, uh, definitely COVID and just not feeling comfortable. While some gym owners are trying to tackle the lockdowns with virtual and outdoor classes, others say personal close-knit groups are the future of fitness trainings. Well, as compared to your, your big box gyms, like um, with all the machinery and heavy bars and whatnot, uh, I've got a solid core of clientele that come in. Um, they've built basically a gym family and they know that each member is here to not only keep them safe, themselves safe, but their, their counterparts safe. We're all in it together and we all want to be successful. The recent research concludes the longer the vaccination process takes, the more unlikely people are to return. In Calgary, Hina Saeed, City News.